Now, before I continue um, with, you know, going a little bit deeper into who, who gets included when we talk about inclusion and who is in charge of selecting who gets included, who has that authority? And again, just why? Who gets these seats and why are spots so limited? Bef I'll get there. But I want to I wanna bring up something because this comes up a lot. <laughs> this comes up a whole lot. So when I initially ran into, you know, troubles and philanthropy, this is before I really knew what was going on. And I'm going to different people, especially black people who I thought I could trust. Now I know better. Um, they would say, you know, see, you got to play the game. You got to play the game. I'm so glad on me and nobody else. Now when people tell me I have to play the game, I respond, which one? I ask that to people who say I need to play the game because I realize black people, y'all have no idea what game is even being played. It's, it's all bravado. You gotta play the game, you gotta play the game. Um, you playing chess. Well, what do they say? Um, you playing checkers, we playing chess. And I'm like, well, no, I'm not playing at all, that part. But I do play the earth game. I do play the game of life. And the game of life has nothing to do with money, status, any of that shit. Um, again, source players, part one, part two, I go into the original earth game as explained in the right use of will. Um, and I'll get into that in the next sleep stage some more, but like, yeah, everybody's like, you know, we playing checkers, we playing chess, shut up. No, you're not. But let me ask you. Let me ask you. Mm, how can you guys see it? This is white people. Okay, we'll say this is Caucasians, right? And then we'll say this is black people right here. And we'll say, like, this highlighter. Mm, we'll put it right here. We'll say, like, this, this highlighter is the goal line that black people are trying to get to, right? All right, so I wanted to ask you all, for those of you who think you have to play the game to get ahead or believe that you are successfully playing the game, really you're getting played, but we'll get there. Do you understand or have you considered that if the people who came before you whether it's immediate people like mom, dad, granddad, aunties, doesn't matter. Or when we talk about ancestors, doesn't matter. Have you ever considered that maybe if the people who came before you didn't make their freedom into a game, that maybe you wouldn't have to still play a game? Does that make sense? Do you all ever consider that maybe if the people who came before you said, fuck these games, our freedom is not a game. It's not a competition and chose to try something different then maybe here in 2022, you wouldn't still have to play that bogus and insane game. To the people who play the game, you all compromise yourselves. You compromise the people around you. For some of you, it doesn't feel like you're compromising because some people just don't have any particular morals or values. Okay. The point I'm getting at is every single time you compromise yourself or someone else, or sell out, or take these little shortcuts, you know, to get ahead. You know, yeah, you get one step ahead, or maybe two steps further ahead. Maybe, you know, even some of y'all, you know, some of y'all actually make it to the other side. Y'all don't have souls anymore, but, you know, y'all don't care. Y'all are there. Um, some of y'all, y'all really get there. All right. 
remember this highlighter is the finish line this is what you really need to know every time you sell out every time you cut out the legs of a person like me every time you compromise yourself or someone else to get ahead in this game that you think you're playing yeah it gets you a little bit closer to that finish line but everybody who really knows the game knows the entire board slides back does that make sense you guys you keep selling out to move just a little bit further on this game board some of y'all like i said some of y'all go for the gusto Ooh, spirits all black and shit and you do all this just to get closer to this finish line not realizing every time you do what you do to get a seat at that table the entire board moved back for everybody including you that's why i said like y'all keep telling me i gotta play the game you don't even know which game and you're getting played now as it pertains to this chess board you know you playing chess beef chess checkers all right fine let's assume that you are actually playing chess and this is what i learned when i went overseas and why i came back different you know y'all are used to this game this square game not realizing this square game is situated within a pyramid and that pyramid is situated within a circle so when you tell me you playing chess you mean this or how about this wait 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 you didn't even know that there were different ways to play chess you just thought it was just this square board and that's why you should never tell me I need to play the game. Y'all have no idea what game you're even playing.